Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create any of the cartoon avatar for your Unreal Engine game project and make the cartoon avatar to become your main avatar or any of the NPC for your Unreal Engine game project. Right, so start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First, we need to go to the CC tree, the character creator tree first. When you open the character creator tree, this is the default avatar and of course we are not going to use this because this is a realistic avatar. We are going to create a cartoon avatar. So what we need to do is click the project here. Project, template, base. Alright, it's under avatar, toon figures. And now I'm, I'm going to create a toon figure here. For example, Yvonne, you have three toon base. You have a toon base and you have a female, you have a male and you have a, a teen girl as well. I will use the female Yvonne, drag it in and click replace all. Or you can click replace avatar only then it would immediately wear the bra and, and the underwear. Click OK. And wait for a while here. Click OK. And now you can see it already loads into your avatar and now I can see some, some of the problems here. Actually, actually I can just press Q and double click it and press delete buttons. And this one also the same, double click it, press delete buttons. Next go to the cloth here and then cloth, underwear, underwear templates and I choose one from here. The bra, click OK. okay next one is the underwear. Double click. Alright, this one have to choose fit body shape. Click OK. Alright, next, we are going to give a hairstyle. A hairstyle, if you want to use the tune base hairstyle, it is at here. Under group, okay, click here, click template, under the group, hair, legacy, character creator, toon hair. Under the toon hair, you have some of the hairstyle that's really suitable for your cartoon. I will use this. Or you can use this as well. Okay, next, what we need to do is give her, give her a dress. As demo, I will use this. Click here, the dress, the template. Click the shirt, give her a shirt, double click, click OK. This is like camiso, fit the body shape, OK, click OK. Right, next, I'm going to give her a pant, click here, drag down. Give, give a shot, click OK. And finally, I will give her a shoes. Of course, all the face and the body shape, you have a lot of more fear that enable you to, to change everything, to modify it. But as demo, I will just show you the process. Next, I'm going to give her a shoes, a shoes here. So under the shoes, choose one, high heels, 
Okay, okay. Alright, next. Everything is perfect already. Next, what you're going to do is send this avatar to Iclont. But you must make sure that your Iclont is already open there. You click here. Send character to Iclont. And you wait in the Iclont, wait for a while. It is transferring. Alright, now this avatar is already in the Iclont 7. Now we can transfer it to, to Unreal Engine's First, you must have the Icon Unreal Life link that already installed in your computer. First thing what you need to do is go to the scenes and now you can see the avatar name is Yvonne. Now I click Icon Unreal Life link, make sure I untick everything here. And I only select the, the character Yvonne. Next, you must make sure that in your Icon, sorry, you must make sure that in your Unreal Engine here, you already have the icon and real life link here that already installed here. If both sites ready, you just make sure that your Unreal Engine 4.26 is already open at there. Next, you back to your icons, make sure you, you only tick the events and click transfer file. It will transfer to your Unreal Engine. So now, it's the time to export and transfer to Unreal Engine. Now I click icon I Unreal Live link and I already make sure that I only tick Yvonne and I click transfer file. Just wait for a while in Unreal Engine. Once it finish, once it finish, it, it will automatic show it here. Now just wait for a while until it done. Now, it finished transfer already, it will back to here. It is under the content, Revolution content, Yvonne. Alright, next. We want to make Yvonne to become the main avatar in this game project. You need to back to the content, go to the mana queen, animations, sorry, mana queen, character, mesh, Make sure you double click the UE4 Mana Queen Skeletons. Next, you have to click Retarget Manager. Make sure you change to select Humanoid Rig here. Then you save. Close. Next, you back to the Mana Queen folder. Double click the animations. Third person animation blueprint. You right click, retarget, and retarget. Here, the skeletons, you have to choose Yvonne. Then, you click retarget. At this moment, it will automatically appear at the content folder. What you need to do is click the top person animation blueprint here, press F2, and rename it, add an underscore, add an underscore behind. Yvonne. Enter. Next, you double click the third person blueprint folder and enter the blueprint folder. You can see a third person character is there. You right click it, duplicate. Next, you rename it by putting an underscore behind Yvonne. Enter. Double click third person character Yvonne. Next, what you are going to do, click the mesh, click the viewport. The skeleton mesh, you change it to Yvonne Skeleton. Here. Change to Yvonne. Next, the animation class, you change it to become the third person animation blueprint, Yvonne. Now everything done. Just have a look, you click compile, click save, and close. Next, delete the mana queen avatar from your map, press delete buttons. Then you click edit project setting. The maps and modes, here you need to change the selected game mode. Default point class, you change it to 
third person character Yvonne. Now the main avatar already become Yvonne. You close, and now you try to play the game. You can see now the main avatar is Yvonne. It's no more Mana Queen. Now this cartoon avatar already become your main avatar in, in, in your Unreal Engine game project. And you also can make her as an NPC. First you delete this. Next you back to this is the content third person blueprint. Blueprint. You can drag the third person character you want to here and press E. You can rotate it. Now this is an NPC as well when you play. Now this is Yvonne NPC and now you are, you are the main avatar Yvonne as well and that's all for today about how to create any of the cartoon avatar and send it to your Unreal Engine game project and make the cartoon avatar to become, become your main avatar in the game or become any of the NPC in your game project and that's all for today, thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animations and game developing you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy animation and game developing! See you!